Having a criminal justice system that upholds and protects the rights of the people it serves is crucial to maintaining the American way of life. In the past, many argued that South Dakota hasn't always provided the resources to guarantee these rights. But the governor's proposed budget is making steps to change that if approved by the state's legislature. Yesterday, during Governor Kristi Noem's budget address, she recommended a plan that would create a statewide appellate defender's office that would be overseen by a statewide indigent defense commission, primarily handling criminal appeals, child abuse, neglect appeals, and habeas appeals. By doing so, the state is trying to create an office that would be more suited to those cases and provide more experienced attorneys to handle those appeals cases for people who can't afford attorneys on their own. If there were a statewide public defender's office that would handle those appellate matters, mm -hmm. it would essentially balance that out so that the lawyers who would be handling those appeals would be much like the special assistant attorney generals who do nothing but handle those appeals, mm -hmm. and you would develop specialists in those areas, and that would be a good thing. If approved, it's projected that the counties would benefit from less spending. In the long run, you save money because when people have effective assistance at counsel, mm -hmm. uh, they can possibly be acquitted or uh, the charges can be lessened somehow, or when they do ultimately uh, get convicted of something before a jury, mm -hmm. it's been done right. So there aren't tens of thousands and millions of dollars spent in uh, post-conviction relief. When it comes to the statewide appellate defender's office, they would also provide training and mentorship to defense attorneys without an additional cost to the budget. NOMA is looking to invest $1.4 million of ongoing funding into this program.